Hey everyone, so look at this. My heater decided to basically explode out of the top there. Right, see I'm doing this upside down. Right here is the actual top of the heater. You can see all of the electronics that are in there. And then there's the actual top top of it, the rubbery part. And then here is the rest of the heater. So there's the bottom. There's your filament inside of it. I think that's what you call that stuff is filament. Uh, which is laying down on the bottom there. And there's the other part of the top. So I've never had this happen before. Uh, so this is a good reason why you should be checking all of your, your equipment every now and then. Probably at least once or twice a week. Uh, because sometimes they just decide to explode. Uh, what I'm guessing is what happened is I had it in this suction cup right here. It probably fell off. Maybe hit the go uh, hit the gravel and then just went or something. That might not actually be it. I don't know what actually happened, but I mean this is just hanging here. So it may have also just decided to pop off of there for some reason. And yeah. Uh, so of course why this is bad is the heating part is not going to work anymore. Uh, my tank is actually up to around 85 degrees. So it's still heating. It's just not heating correctly. Uh, it's preset to, I think it's like 76 or 77 degrees. It's one of those preset heaters, uh, 50 watt heaters. And this was a 5 gallon tank. Um, it was, again, around 76-ish degrees. Now it's up to about 85 degrees. So that's one reason why it's very bad. The other main reason is, though, is it's going to cause... A good chance it'll cause like an electrical current to be going out into your tank, which of course then if you touch the water you'll get an electrical shock. And anything that was in that was in the uh, tank is going to get electrical shock as well, which is not a good thing. That will end up killing your fish, uh, so your heater will murder your fish. Uh, yeah, so I guess just pay attention to your heater because sometimes they just decide to explode. Uh, this one I've had for probably, I'm going to guess, five, six years. Used it in multiple other tanks. And I guess it just kind of gave out or something happened and, you know, this, yeah, so then it kind of exploded. Nuts. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time.